Hi guys, it's Granny Turner speaking. Welcome to this FS25 Fact Sheet video. It's Fact Sheet Friday again and we got four more fact sheets about machines and appliances. And we start already with a combine harvester from the manufacturer class, which is a German one. And yeah, it looks rather normal and small. It is not one of those, the biggest of the world combine harvesters, but it's a small one. It's from uh, family farms or just small and normal farms. It's called Evion 450. And I already saw it at Agritechnica last year and they were very proud on this machine, even if it's a small combine, because it's so modern and so useful and it's working so good. And therefore it had a dedicated place and there were always at least one class um, guy standing around ready to answer questions. And because this is the very, very new combine of class and they they have bigger ones but this is a new a class of the class <laughs> combines for the small farms yeah it has 258 horsepower 500 liter fuel tank 8000 liter for the grain it costs 226500 it has variable gears and on the road you can drive 40 kilometers per hour or 24 miles per hour. The weight is 11.5 tons. And you can see what can go into the bunker. It's all types of grain plus corn and sunflower. But you, for those you need a different header. And then we also have the header, which is a normal header and the Vario 620. Uh, the weight is 2.2 tons. The working speed is 6 kilometers per hour or six, no, 10 kilometers per hour or 6 miles per hour and it costs 52,000 bucks. The working width is 6.2 meters. And you can harvest all types of grain plus soybeans and the new long grain rice. And yeah, from the facts, this combine harvester is rather similar to the top liner that we had in FS22 as a basic combine and it only costs half of this price. But the top liner is an old vintage um, harvester and this class is uh, the newest thing that class builds. And therefore it's obviously more expensive. And I think it's nice. Uh, on my German channel there are quite a lot of people who were waiting whether this will come. And I always told them, I'm sure it will come because it was shown at Agritechnica and they will bring it to FarmSim uh, 25. And here it is. Okay, let's go on. Here we have the new green bean harvester from Oxbow, the PB2140A. And yeah, it's good for harvesting beans, green beans. It has 315 horsepower, 850 liter fuel tank, 15 liter bunker a place for the, for the beans, which is quite nice. The working width is 3.3 meters. It costs 498, 500 bucks, which is quite a lot. And it has variable gears. The, Speed on the road is 25 kilometers per hour or 15 miles per hour. It weighs 19.5 tons and the working speed is 10 
km per hour or 6 miles per hour. Yeah, and it is, as I thought, it's a rather expensive machine, which is normal. You only have to look at this machine and you know that it is an expensive machine. And that makes bean farming quite expensive. So either you have to build up your farm for several years to be able to harvest beans, or you start as farm manager and you concentrate on beans and do nothing else, then you could buy this rather early in the game. Okay, let's go on. This is a disc harrow from Delbo, the Power Chain 800, and the tractor is of no concern for this fact sheet. It's only about this disc harrow. And you need 180 horsepowers to work with it. It weighs 5.6 tons. The working speed is 18 kilometers per hour or 11 miles per hour. It costs 43,000 bucks and it has 300 liter tank for seeds. Yes, for seeds. You can saw grass or oil seed radish with this machine. So you can use it for um yeah for cultivating after the harvest and then sowing oil seed radish and have your field fertilized with an organic method uh, for the future sowing for something else. Yeah, the working width is 8 meter and yeah, so it's quite big, rather big. I think for American standards it's more on the smaller side, but it's not the very small one. Yeah, okay, and then next here we have the Anna Burger trailer and I was wondering what's this all about? I see one trailer and one tractor in, in the front. This seems to be a Deutz tractor and there is no, no mentioning of this tractor. So it's all about the trailer. But we have two things on this fact sheet. I can only see one trailer and therefore I had a look at the website and I found out that Anna Burger is offering a system where you can buy the wheels and everything that has to do with the wheels as a separate asset and then you can choose what comes on top. Either a normal, yeah, I wouldn't call it trailer because it has doesn't have any wheels. You buy the wheels separately. Um, but you can put stuff inside. It's maybe it's something like a tipper or so. And they also have tanks and all kinds of different things that you can attach to those wheels. And yeah, so you buy different things, two different things. The wheel thingy with all the metal around is the HTS 22B.79, uh, sorry, and you need 180 horsepower to work with this, and it costs uh, 38,000 bucks and it weighs 4.8 tons without the tipper on top. And then we have the AV, AW22.17 and you can get it in, a, uh, in different configurations. So it has 25 up to 36 cubic meters. But I guess only the 36 uh, cubic meters is this um, tipper-like thing. I don't even think that think that it tips. I don't know. Uh, but you can 
carry stu all your stuff or your bulk stuff with it. And the other might be a slurry tank, because we have a working width of 24 meters. And so maybe the configuration is not so much about different size for a tipper trailer, but more of different objects that you can attach to the wheels. And then uh, you have to several different kinds of trailers to use. This is not yet clear from this um, fact sheet, but on the website I saw there are all different kinds of things that you can attach to those wheels. And in reality it wouldn't work like that, that you have this tipper traily, trailer thingy First, then you go to the workshop and use your screwdriver three times and then suddenly you have a slurry tank that would never work, so you have to buy two different things. But in-game it could maybe work that you go with your tipper trailer and then pay a little bit or a lot of money and have a slurry tank suddenly. Maybe that's how it would work because this working width um, makes me wonder and therefore I think maybe it's the slurry tank. But maybe it's totally completely different. But what is uh, sure is that we need to buy two different things to get one trailer. And the cost of this AW22.17 is 35,000 bucks and it weighs 3.8 tons. And you can carry all kind of bulk stuff with it. Everything except the grapes, as we are already used from FS22. Okay, that's it about the fact sheets from this Friday. I wish you a wonderful day. Oh no, I wanted to ask you what you like best from this, those fact sheets here. Yeah, and we have this Anna Burger combination, the Disc Harrow from Delbom, the Oxbow Harvester and the Class Combine. For me, I like best the Class Combine. Maybe because I saw it already and I like smaller things and yeah, it is a um, very modern version of a sm medium small combine and that's what I like about this. But there are interesting other machines and maybe you like something else. Please write it in the comments below. And I wish you a wonderful day. Thank you for watching and all the best. Till next time. Tschüss.